Parade Marshal Kathy McDonald brings the field out onto the track for tonight's first race. Daily double and exacto waging also trifecta. No changes in tonight's daily double. Number one is Swango, leased by Albert Van Schleich, driven by Jody Yussing. Two is Jerry Direct, owned by Rebecca Dwyer with Mike Wilder. Three is Alert Bart, owned by Glenn and Barbara Bottoms. The Rainsman is Charlie Conrad. Number four, PJ's Little Fame, owned by Thurman Tackett with Jeff Fout. Five is Rambo Lane, owned by Jeffrey and Kevin Reed. Dean Collins will be in the bike. Six is the French Falcon, owned by Kerry Costa and Mitchell Jaffe, driven by Rodney Connor. Number seven is Pan It Up, owned by Scott Glendon and Mark Gator. Dan Ader will be in the bike. Number eight, Shannon Partner, owned by James Woodward, Molly Bush, and Brett Merkel. Brett Merkel will be in the sulky. Field for the first five minutes till post time. Starting gate is underway. Field for tonight's first race is at the gate and moving through the clubhouse turn. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're often pacing. Alert Bart between horses takes the lead. Swango quickly on the rail. Jerry Direct in between horses. Rushing up on the far outside. Rambo Lane and a mad scramble for the turn. On the extreme outside, French Falcon three deep to fifth. Around this top turn, the other three year old, PJ's Little Fame. Handed up is Gapping and Shannon Partner trails, and they're absolutely flying to the quarter mile pole. Swango's going to light it up in 26 and 4. They started already on a warm Saturday night, driving past the stands. Alert, Bart on the outside. Swango along the rail. This is some hard ball in here. Don't even want to visualize what the teletimer is going to be at the half. Swango by ahead. Alert, Bart still on the rim, second and challenging. French Falcon flying high to third. Around the lower turn, Jerry Direct into fourth. Moving up on the outside, Rambo Lane, PJ's Little Fame, pan it up, and Shannon Partner, 56 flat there down the backstretch. Swango puts away Alert Bart, but he'll have plenty of challengers in the final three-eighths of a mile. Swango bouncing along with a two-length advantage. Jerry Direct picks up the chase second. Here comes Dean Collins. He's out and moving into the Rambo Lane with his horse, and he's now under the whip, charging by three-quarters. Swango is there in 124, around the far turn and ready to face the strong headwind into the stretch. We'll see if Swango can last. Swango on top by two. Rambo Lane, panted up, is up on the far outside. French Falcon is fourth, they're into the stretch. Jody Essig is all over Swango. Swango with a short lead. Rambo Lane up on the outside. French Falcon, panted up. Late close, Shannon Partner. Two wide here, and who do you like the six, French Falcon? Six French Falcon, the unofficial winner, five. Rambo Lane was second. Number seven, panned up third and eight. Shannon Partner fourth. Result of the first race, now official. Here comes the winner, French Falcon. Five-year-old bay horse by Falcon Almahurst out of Mary D. Album. Owned by Kerry Costa and Mitchell Jaffe of Millis and Framingham, Mass. Driven and trained by Rodney Connor. Coming to out here in 154 and three. It's a lifetime best. For number six, French Falcon, the winner. Windows are now up and on tonight's second race. Second race tonight, sponsored by Brittany Farms. First of two, three-year-old Colt Trots. Colt Trot, post time 13 minutes away at 7.18. Next post, 7.18, 6.5 exact, the $56.80. 
56.80. The try, 203.80, 203.80. No changes in tonight's second race. Field of six, exact and trifecta wagering. 